What is up, you guys? It's your girl, Isabella Tara Tarot, back at it again. I'm going to hit you with your monthly reading. Thank you so much for all of the likes, shares, subscribes, comments, all of the support to this channel. It's greatly appreciated. Before we jump into your reading, I need to start off by letting you know I'm not sugarcoating shit in my readings. So, if you're a whiny little bitch or entitled little bitch living to only hear yes and stay blind to what's going on around you, please click off this video. I don't stroke egos here. Have the day you deserve. All right. I'm currently accepting personals at this time. The only way to book with me is through my Etsy spiritual shop listed in the description box below, as well as the link to Patreon to access exclusive content. There are three tiers. The first tier is all the extended videos and daily energy readings. The second tier is Bella's Book of Shadows and all of the above. The third tier is a 10 minute personal reading. Um, and all of the above. Make sure to send me your name, your birthday, and the topic or question that you're wanting us to look into for that personal reading. All right, that being said, let's go ahead and get into your reading. Leos, we're going to go ahead and jump into your reading. I have already started this a few times, and I can't put that message out, y'all. If it comes out again, I will, but it's going to be short, sweet, and to the point because I just can't. Like, I, like there is nothing wrong with liking the same sex if that is your thing and you know you own that shit but don't be in full-blown relationships with somebody who ain't got a fucking clue man jesus christ i'm like why did this keep coming out in leo reed either y'all know somebody like i'm not i'm hoping that don't come out again but y'all either know somebody that's about to go through some real shit in the month of december where everything is getting exposed and everybody knows or you know it's in it's in a partnership or relationship that you're dealing with okay um, and this will be for those of you who have gone back to somebody from the past who it's like there was no emotional connection to, but it's like y'all keep going back to each other, all right? Lupus comes out, comes out. What in the world comes out, comes out? Came out. Oh. Somebody who's very in and out because I'm seeing a bunny here. Six of swords as well, moving forward, moving out of this energy, okay? We've got... Pictures, Astros, Ten of Cups. Somebody's going towards their happiness in the month of December, that's for sure. All right. Deneb Katos. Okay. And that looks like a heart and a home. Okay. King of Pentacles, Ten of Cups, and Six of Swords. All right. I feel like things are definitely changing in the month of December for you. For those of you who were wondering when things were going to move or be shook, they're being shaken up in the month of December, but it looks like in a good way, okay? Um, look, as we sh shift through all of the Leo energy, let's see what else they need to know in the month of December. What does the Leo need to know in the month of December? Fast cash, that looks good. Yeah, let's get on finances, please. <laughs> okay. Damn it, I'm putting that back in. If it comes out again, I'll take it. That'll be the fourth time that I've pulled it for y'all but oh i don't want that message so they throw the shit in the floor that's fine it's fine okay um cut and clear spell work for some of you you have been under some kind of spiritual attack that you are being able to get yourself out of in this time we've got therapy and contracts so i feel like some of you may have um been working on yourselves in the month of December, okay, and are starting to get new contracts. I feel like there is something that you are having a hard time getting out of or moving away from. I feel like you're going to be able to do that in the month of December. Um, I get that you're also having very, I, got, I was going to say vivid dreams, but I'm seeing visions down here. So you may have literally been having visions of things to come in the month of December. Um, it's almost like I feel like y'all are, like, there's something about... Re, I heard re-upping your finances, your money, you're on fire in regards to that. Things are really starting to take off, okay? I feel like you are having visions of who you need to link up with and who you don't need, okay? We've got Doppelganger and Sugar Daddy. This kind of goes along with what I was saying previously. I feel like there's somebody who is trying to get your attention in this time, okay? It's like they try, whoever this is, it's like I feel like they're not necessarily a bloodsucker, but I feel like they are the type of person who 
Um, they ha they can they don't have their own energy. They've got to pull from your energy. They don't have their own. They don't. Um, they can't handle the things that you handle on a daily basis. So they literally suck not suck the life out of you. But I feel like they uh, drain you of this energy. Okay, Drake. Um, they're over here draining you of your energy. All right. Um, I feel like you may have called this person out or said something about them being a draining individual. I feel like you are a little cutthroat in the month of December. I'm not even going to lie. I feel like you're coming through very blunt and very honest um, to where it's making somebody who has basically been draining your energy have to step back and look at you and like, whoa. Um, I am going to let you know this person is going to play the victim. Just be prepared. They're going to play the victim because I feel like this is somebody who you've either got some kind of emotional attachment to or financial attachment to. Um, I feel like they're literally going to play the victim. They feel like they can get back on your good side with gifting. Okay, I got gift giving. All right. Um, it's almost like they can say whatever they want to say as long as they give you um, something to smooth it over afterwards. You're going to forgive them. That's what I got. Fast cash therapy, contracts, fire, and visions heard i can see clearly now the rain is gone i feel like you are um really opening someone's eyes in the month of december as well um especially in the workplace i feel like you're on fire in your workplace okay i feel like there's like things going wrong at your place of employment to where they have to call you in to come and fix some shit okay um i do get that people come to you a lot for advice um, I feel like your energy is also very therapeutic. I feel like you are doing this. I'm doing this. It's not really new. It feels like you are doing this thing where you look up a lot. You research a lot. Okay. You're not a dumbass. And I feel like in some way you're making money off this or you could. Um, your spirit guides are coming through telling you, trying to, I heard lift your spirits Okay, there may have been a situation that kind of got you down at one point in time, but I feel like your spirit guides are coming through to lift your spirits in the month of December. I feel like they're putting you on the right track. They're showing me a train as well. Train tracks, putting you back on the right track. I feel like you might have gotten off a little bit, um, but I feel like you are coming back into your own energy like i'm telling you like i feel like you might have not felt like yourself for quite some time um but you're finally getting that i heard get that old thing back for so for some of y'all y'all ain't coming for me on my my damn channel but I, I don't come for me like i feel like some of you are um either renewing an old contract or renewing an old relationship okay um get that old thing back is what i heard so um don't be don't be shocked we got the love true love came out um for some of you there is an individual from your past i'm not saying this is somebody that you were um actually with this could be somebody from your past you know who's been watching you for quite some time um i feel like you both of you may have gone and done different things but they're trying to come back to you in this time okay or trying to kind of get your attention in this time okay i feel like they're going to i heard shoot their shot so um in the month of december somebody's gonna try to shoot their shot to get you your attention okay i feel like it's going like they know that you're with somebody or dealing with someone and they're going to try to shoot their shot Shot, all right um don't be shocked i feel like this person um this person who is going to try to come in king of coins like i feel like they are very financially um well off or they handle their shit hold on Yeah, they're financially well off or they're a very good worker, okay? Um, I feel like they're also going to be trying to give you some kind of gift, okay? I feel like they're going to try to also get things to move forward with you. Um, I feel like this person, it's like they're not necessarily a very giving person to other people, but they're coming in trying to give to you in the month of December, all right? Um to show like the sugar daddy came out too, yeah, okay? Um, I feel like for some of you, you may have thought that you had wanted a certain individual only to find out that that person wasn't shit, okay? Um, I feel like you may have gotten the concept of true, let's see, true, not true love, uh, soulmate versus twin flame and karmics all mixed up. And y'all, I'm not going to be the one to sit here and break that shit down for you. But I feel like there's a situation that is going to put things into perspective for you in the month of December to where you're actually starting to see who's who with these visions coming through. 
I'm getting your intuition is on point in the month of December. Like you're seeing through all the bullshit. You're seeing through um, the lies that are being told to your face, okay? I feel like for some of you, you're going to call somebody out on it. Um, they're not going, it's like the way that they're going to apologize isn't strictly to say that they're sorry. There, there's something that they're going to do. Let me see. What was this person going to do? Cause I don't feel like it's like in a, it's like the energy of a point to let bygones be bygones and apology, but I don't feel like they're saying it. The emperor. I don't feel like they're going to say it. I don't feel like they're going to say it. I feel like they are going to not tuck tail and run, but for some of you, they may tuck tail and run. But they're feeling remorse, but they're not going to speak on it. I feel like the person that you're dealing with has a huge ego. But it's like, I feel like you might have been the one to build that ego for them. All right? I feel like they want, they know they need to apologize. But the way that they're coming through, I feel like they may have a tendency of being very condescending as well. All right? Um, this is a person that needs to apologize to you. And you know who that is. Each of you is, is somebody different. But I feel like you are starting to recognize the difference between um, what it was that you thought you wanted versus what you actually wanted. So uh, I feel like you're actually going to start moving more so in the direction of true love and happiness in the month of December instead of letting the old past fool, the fools from the past, keep you down. I'm also getting this energy of somebody coming in, possibly an Aries, um, who is pissed off about the fact that you can be happy without them. That's what I'm seeing. Especially with that emperor and the um, coins. I feel like you are finding a way to be happy. I heard making a way out of no way. But it's like if, they, if they're not in Aries, they've got it in their chart. It could be a Capricorn. But I'm definitely seeing it. Somebody who you've cut out that they're mad that they're being cut out. Okay. Um, but I feel like they are... I'm seeing three of coins. You may have, con look, I say you may have contracts. It says contracts. You may, like, you, you have some kind of contract with this individual, all right? What's going to happen with this contract? Therapy. It's going to be revised. There's a, there's a revision, com revision or a change coming in regards to some kind of contract or agreement. And I feel like there is going to be some money attached to this as well. I feel like you, Leo, are going to come into some financial status. Because of some kind of revision. Or if it's not financial status, it's just like coming into um, some form of prosperity. Yeah, and we got nine of coins too. Hell yeah, you about to get some money. Uh, Leo's about to see some big money in the month of December. Or things starting to change in the month of December. For those of you who are um, employed, I'm definitely seeing new contracts being formed. Okay, I feel like if you are wanting to ask for a raise, now is the time. I definitely see that you're going to get it. Um... <clears throat> I feel like there's something about the way that you do things, the way that you handle things, your work ethic. Your boss wishes somebody else would fucking take that kind of initiative is what I'm getting. They wish. They wish. Okay, and I feel like you may have also told somebody about themselves in the in the in the place of employment. <laughs> yeah, they didn't like that. You didn't they didn't like it, okay? I feel like it's also a clown. I feel like there's like this energy that like you're showing up like is it Shaka Khan over here? And they're showing up like the fucking hyenas. All right? Some dumb asses. A bunch of dumb asses. You work with a bunch of dumb asses. Okay? That's what I'm seeing. All right? Um, I feel like you are definitely bodying these hoes in regards to your business and career. Um, for those of you who are in business for yourself, I feel like can't nobody um, compete with you. Especially in this time, people are starting to recognize your worth. And I feel like you may be getting offers. Um, not only, I had said that I'm seeing three of coins. There it goes. Splits the deck, three of coins. Um, there are new offers on the table coming for you in this time. I even feel, y'all... This, ain't, this one's not for everybody. But I definitely feel the energy of even your fucking haters want to work with you. Even your haters are trying to find a way to collab with you. Um, because it's like you know what the fuck you're doing. Okay? I feel like they, they're... They're not complete. I feel like they may feel some type of way about the fact that you get the, um, the attention... But I feel like they know that they're ha like something's forcing these to shut up in this time. Um, I feel like your haters are actually scared and wanting to work with you in this time. I feel like you are 
um, also being given some kind of more control. I feel like you're being given more control in your work environment. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, I feel like the people who were sitting there snickering behind your back or snickering period are about to have to tire. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Okay. I'm getting that you will be getting a raise in the month of December. or You're going to be getting some form of compensation from your um, career. That's not just your regular money. Um, I feel like your career may be giving out some of y'all may be getting gift cards, um, incentive to work, bonuses. I heard sign-on contracts. So for some of you, there may be some kind of benefit to signing on with a certain company. Um, I feel like your money is fire in the month of December. If you were worried about your how your finances were going to be, I don't feel like there's any reason to worry. I definitely feel like there's somebody who is like livid over the fact that you just keep getting some kind of come up, financial come up, all right? But that's not your problem. We don't give a fuck. Um, I, I think the main thing that Spirit's wanting to say is, bitch, you doing a good job, bitch. You doing a good job. Fuck that laundry. Fuck that dish. I don't know where that's coming from. Some of y'all are done doing laundry. Some of y'all may be starting to pay someone to do your damn laundry. Because the way that it's looking, y'all's money is looking really good in the month of December. For some of you, if you were trying to refinance or shift money, put money in different accounts, offshores, whatever you're trying to do, it looks like it's going to be very, um, like you're getting profit. Like some of you are choosing to put money into stocks. That's also going to do very well for you in the month of December if you've got stocks, okay? Um, it's almost like there is a complete shift happening for you. I feel like you're literally, I heard rags to riches. So there's something about being able to live completely different, um, new tax brackets for y'all in the month of December. Okay. Um, I, if things were a little tight at one point in time, they're not going to be tight anymore. I feel like you are getting very smart in the way that you handle your finances, your, your money period. All right. I feel like y'all may even have set, like I heard several accounts. Okay. Um, it's really taken off and it's looking really good. I feel like somebody's having to also eat their words because of some kind of, um, elevation that you're getting in regards to your finances. Um, and it feels good. It feels good. I see this. It feels good. You over here in your, um, <laughs> I <laughs> said tiara, okay, your crown, your jewels, all right, some of you may be investing in jewels, jewelry, okay, I heard for yourself, okay, that sugar daddy, you may have someone who is gifting you lots of jewelry in the month of December, okay, somebody's definitely wanting to come through for you in the month of December financially, um, I, I think I did say something about second chances, somebody's gonna want a second chance with you as well, um, I feel this energy of Look, Serpent and Slytherin did come back in. <laughs> Slytherin. Mm. Um, that's just, we're just not, okay. Like, I feel like there is um, somebody from your past who is trying to come back because they're seeing how well you're doing, trying to slither up in that, get a piece of that, okay. I heard a piece of that ass, okay. I feel like it's somebody who you may have had a very good, It's a snake, y'all. It's a snake. At the end of the day, it's a snake. And the side it fell on, I'm just like, you don't want to trust this individual. There is somebody coming back in um, <clears throat> trying to start something up with you who is a snake. Okay, let's see if we will can we clarify who this person is so they know for real, for real. And another snake came out. I got a water serpent came out. All right. They may have Sag in their chart. Or they may appear in the world. Look, could be Gemini as well. Or vice versa. You take it how you need to take it. Infinity. Um, I feel like this person is someone who also mirrors like that. What I was I, what I was just telling y'all. What was I just telling you guys about twin flames versus soulmate? And I wasn't getting into the ship. Okay. I feel like the person who is trying to come back and to get in I heard your get in your good graces is somebody who y'all had the worst, the most toxic ass relationship. And this person, any chance they had to fuck you over, they did it. And I'm getting that they will do it again. I feel like you know what it is that you want. Like wish fulfillment is not this motherfucker who's trying to make a resurface, resurface, 
in this time, okay? Um, I'm getting all that glitters isn't gold. I'm also getting something that looks good isn't as good as you think it is. I feel like there's some kind of motive here as well, all right? They show up as someone who, it's like they may, I'm telling you, they may look good. They may have good sex, but I feel like this motherfucker, it's like they're not only dumb, they're going to take you down. It's like they, they the it's about the quest or about the challenge. It's something about a challenge to get you, you may be a challenge. All right, and this person, they're only coming back around for the challenge. And the second that they get you from whoever you're dealing with, if you're with somebody, the same cycle is going to repeat itself because I am seeing repeating cycles as well. I feel like you need to um, definitely get very clear on what you need around you and who you need around you. Um, you're going to know the difference because I feel like this other individual, I feel like that's also who we've been talking about. It's like an undercover um I heard I said homo I heard a homophobe okay but five of swords is somebody who constantly keeps you in mental conflict and like just wondering if you're good enough or if you should be doing something someone who makes you stay in your head about how you need to be moving forward okay somebody who makes possibly makes you question um your feminine aspects okay or it's either they have very fucked up feminine aspects or something going on with that Anyways, that's what I'm seeing for you guys in the month of December. We're going to get an angel oracle. What does Leo need to know in the month of December? We've got Earth Angel. You are a light worker who has come to Earth to teach about love. I feel like there is, it's like not only is your finances looking not only are your finances looking really good some of you may have to check your grammar in this time check yourself before like say watch what you say before you say it out loud i feel like getting grounded is also going to help you in the month of december but it says cut and clear right there and underneath it was cut your cord so there is some kind of karmic attachment that's trying to resurface that you may literally need to do some kind of ritual for um for yourself to, you know, sever the tie between you and this individual. Hopefully this is the last time this motherfucker comes back around. Because anytime this does, it, it's it's like destructive shit. We've got Ask Archangel Michael to clear any old attachments to fear that stems from past re relationships. Freeing you from destructive patterns. There is somebody who you're going to have to sit and like meditate on before you even respond um, to this person. Because it's like they have the ability to... Um, take you where you don't want to go and get you all riled up is what I'm getting. There's somebody who um, is going to try to come in and, and stir some kind of emotion, whether it's like rage or like make you feel some type of way for them. You just need to remain balanced, okay? And I feel like you know which cords you need to cut and which ones you need to hang on to. I feel like if you don't, you will be getting clear on who is who in the month of December. Um, anyways, that is what I'm seeing for you guys. Don't forget to like the video, share, comment, subscribe. I will see you guys later. Bye.